Today, the city of Orlando is celebrating its longest serving mayor, Carl Lingford. I'm Natalie Diaz. Next on West 2 News, I'll give you the details of this historic ceremony from inside the First Baptist Church of Orlando. This is as real as it gets. I'm flying a simulation of the F-35 fighter that will essentially be replacing over 20 years of aircraft for the U.S. Air Force. Up next on West 2 News, residents and some business owners are gathering here in Orlando at the American Legion Center to learn about a new construction project. I'm Natalie Diaz. Stick around. I'll tell you how it could affect your daily commute and just how much this project is going to cost. Neighbors say they're used to hearing gunshots in this area, but when shots ring out in this residence behind me, crime investigators rush to the scene. Now, Cindy Boswick says as far as she's concerned, swimming in the lake alone is going to be a thing of the past for her husband and her son. Up next on West 2 News, students, teachers and faculty are attending what is the last school board meeting for the rezoning of Longwood Elementary. Stick around. I'll tell you what will happen to that now vacant elementary school. A debt, a weapon, and then a robbery. I'm Natalie Diaz. Why investigators say two home invaders stole a bunch of toys. Kelly's attorney says she told her boyfriend to never re-enter this quaint house she owns, but when Petros re-entered, her attorney says he was trespassing. On Sunday, this home behind me was also struck by lightning and residents had to leave because the damage was so bad. Now, just a couple of days later, firefighters are attending a house just across the street that got struck by lightning too.